Good afternoon, guys. Brett Jackrell here from MotoElectricVehicles.com, sales manager, and I have not been more excited than I am today to release this video to you guys. This is our five-passenger EMS paramedic responder vehicle from MotoElectricVehicles.com. And this took a lot of work, a lot of thinking, a lot of suggestions uh, from actually one of the top suppliers of automobiles in the United States. We'll leave it at that. So uh, once again, these are perfect for uh, different uh, sections of the industry. I'm talking hospitals. I'm talking football departments where you have to use it as a medic vehicle on the field. Uh, manufacturing plants to obviously get someone maybe that had heat stroke out of the manufacturing plant to an ambulance. Uh, there's all sorts of applications where we've been selling our EMS models, and this is now our top-end model. We have a low model, a mid-model, and a top-end model, and boy, am I excited to show you guys this work of art. I just keep looking at it, and guys, th this is amazing work here. So with no further ado, I really want to uh, go over some of the features of the vehicle. Why is it our top-end model? Uh, what, it, what do we do on this vehicle? Why do we like this vehicle better than the mid-model and the lower model? So I'll do that as a side shot. And then I'm going to show you guys some of the equipment we put on here because we got some high-powered equipment, almost $21,000 of stretchers and power loaders on here, uh, which is not included in the price, but we can also do it for you. So with no further ado, let's hop right to it and get to the video review of the five-passenger EMS paramedic responder from Moto Electric Vehicles. All right, so a side shot of the new five-passenger EMS paramedic responder. Let's start out. I mean, the main thing is the five passengers. So where do we get that? You actually can fit probably three people here, but we went ahead and just called it two people per seat just for a comfort fit because you guys are going to have a lot of medic gear and all that type of stuff. So you got two here, uh, a captain chair behind it and a captain chair behind it. Now, um, you could even get away with doing one more captain chair reverse facing, but as a standard model, we wanted to go ahead and set it up as a five passenger. So you got two in the front, captain chair, captain chair, and then your fifth passenger is on the stretcher. Now, with this vehicle, I can't stress this enough, I want to be very clear about this, that the standard model is going to come with our, our normal cot fastener antler type setup. So you'll have your antler in the front with your lockdown post in the back. That's what comes standard. Now, if you guys want to upgrade and get a power loaded stretcher and get the, the locking system for the striker stretcher, we can sell that to you as well. Uh, a lot of people ask us to include it in the price because they don't want to do two different purchases, one to striker, one to us. So we can go ahead and get this for you so ask your sales representative if you want it but once again standard five passenger setup you'll have the antlers up here with the locking system stretcher is not included okay let's get that out of the way let's go ahead on to the vehicle so once again on all of our EMS models whether you get the golf cart the midline or the top line here you're gonna get a rhino line deck and what that's gonna give you is a nice textured deck that's gonna hold up to the abuse of the stretcher going in and out so we got a rhino line deck um, you have a standard two box setup, so the boxes we actually made really, really deep. And uh, it's kind of hard to show you, but I can fit my hand all the way in here. That's the best, and I'm not even touching it. So the good thing about the top end model is it's wider than the mid model and the golf cart. So you get about a five and a half uh, foot clearance here of the width, and we made the box go all the way from here all the way back to where you can see the deck is mounted on the other side. So you got a lot of room for a lot of med gear and whatnot in there. We've even had some EMS departments tell us to light this, so when you open up the door, the light comes on. I mean, we could do all that. That's all extra, but we can do it. And the really nice thing is it's actually lockable and the keys are up in the front. So you can lock this box. Uh, same thing, same dimension. You got another box. You can see this customer has the battery water system, so we went ahead and put that in there. I'll get to that a little bit later. Um, but once again, on this, this is built on our nine passenger electric shuttle chassis and we cut it down. We do all the modifications in house. We're a super custom shop, um, which is also really nice because we can kind of do whatever you want. Um, this vehicle comes with 12 inch aluminum rims, so they won't rust on you. They have a DOT tire, so you can go over asphalt, gravel, indoors, whatever you guys want. Other than loose sand, these tires will handle it. They're just like trailer tires. Um, and then basically what we did is, and one of the reasons why I really like this model, is the deck is wider than our bubble model. Now, let me be very clear. This is our top end model. If you guys don't have it in the budget to go with something like this, we've been selling the golf cart and the bubble model for eight years and they work out great. But if you're looking for like something that's electric, that's going to do the job, that's really, really nice and meant to actually 
do what you guys need to do and get the person to an ambulance. This is, there's nothing on the market like this, guys. It's the best EMS cart, and I, I don't usually say that often, but I know the industry. I look, I've been doing this for 15 years. This is easily the best EMS cart on the market right now, okay? And it only is coming in around 25, 26 grand, which is really nice. Um, so yeah, you got your supports back here. Um, and once again, I wanted to go over the side of the vehicle, uh, emergency lights, we have Whalen PAs, we'll go all over that in the next seg uh, uh, following segments. But what I really wanna do is show you the stretcher and how easy this thing is to unload and offload. Because once again, you guys are used to Striker or Ferno stretchers going into an ambulance, they have all the top end equipment. It's the same thing on this and it's beautiful work by our guys. So with no further ado, I wanna show you the stretcher. I also wanna show you how you get to the batteries because we actually did something pretty cool on that as well. All right, guys, we're on the back side of the five passenger EMS paramedic responder from Moto Electric Vehicles. And I wanna go over a few things here and do some demonstrations for you. First thing I wanna show you is obviously the EMS lights and how clean the installs are. I go over this a lot when we're dealing with our accessories. All of our installs are super, super clean. You can see that we make handmade brackets to make it look cosmetically correct. Wire looms used, it's wired with the fuse. We do things actually the correct way and that's what I try to stress. It sounds funny, but a lot of people cut corners. We don't cut corners. So you'll see you have the basically the, uh, the lights here uh, wired to the brackets. Um, and then basically what I wanted to really go over is the power loader stretcher and what we have here. So. Uh, just as a reminder, our customer here on this vehicle actually bought this equipment. He bought the striker stretcher. It's a power loaded one. Um, he also got the lockdown. So we installed everything for him. But moving forward, you actually will be able to procure those items directly through us. So just make sure you ask a sales representative and we can go over and work with striker on some of the options we have. But once again, um, with this, if you get the top end equipment, this is almost like $21,000 worth of equipment here. I wanted to demonstrate it. So you basically, you got a, rele uh, a release lever here. Okay, and you're gonna come out, and the great thing about this is it lets it where basically it'll lock into place. So you'll see I'll pull this out, and then with one press of the button, okay, lower it to the ground, all right, and then I actually, you have to release the lever up here, okay, and then you're good to go, and the stretcher's off. Now, how easy is that, guys? That is beautiful, well-designed uh, products from Stryker. Now, you're probably used to this uh, because Stryker's been around a long time, but no, no one has ever put something like this on an electric shuttle. And once again, something like this is meant to save lives. We're not here and giving you a rigged up golf cart. I mean, this is a beautiful work. We do it, the antlers if you want something standard, but if you want the top of the top, we can do that. And that's why we wanted to demonstrate it here. So I'm gonna put it back on and show you guys how this works. So you're gonna bring it over here. You have a patient on there. And then the great thing about this is it actually will line it up for you. So I'm up. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and lift it up. And then look, it guides it right on there and locks into place. <laughs> it's beautiful, guys. This, this is one, I'm telling you, this is one of the best vehicles we have ever sold, Moto Electric, since 2006 when we opened. So once again, you got your striker stretcher back here with your power loader there. Uh, you got all your safety uh, lights as far as your blinkers, your four ways, your reverse, your brake lights, everything's back here but you can't ask for more. Um, accessory wise, just real quick, you can do something here. You can see this is a lot of wasted space. So you can put maybe a reverse seat facing back or another storage box. We've even done EMS enclosures. So there's all sorts of things that you can do on this to customize it, fire uh, hydrants, uh, or I'm sorry, fire uh, extinguishers, um, all that type of stuff you can put on here. So with no further ado, I wanna go ahead and show you the front where all the switchboards and the whale and siren, and everything's installed and show you that. And then uh, we'll wrap this thing up. All right guys, sitting inside the cab where the majority of the driving's obviously gonna take place. And I really haven't even gotten to some of the features. I'll go over that as well. But just to go over the features of the cab, you got a nice wood grain steering wheel. Uh, like I always tell on our buses, our steering wheels are raised up, not out. So it's a nice, uh, you know, uh, grip here. And it doesn't feel like uh, for someone that's a little bit bigger, like you're claustrophobic. Um, you got left and right blink blinker. You got headlights, bright, um, you know, volt meter, amp meter, how fast you're going 
your battery meter so you always know where you are on a charge. Everything's right in front of you, which is really nice. Um, you got fog lights as well, forward and reverse, which is real nice with a backup alarm. But it, everything is real simple, and that's the really nice thing about this. Now, going over some of the features, we got our toggle switch here with a momentary switch. So if you have it on the on position, there's a little uh, momentary switch here that will actually flash the pattern. There's like 30 something patterns um, that you'll have there. And then once again, like I told you in the last segment, we don't cut corners. We're not gonna put it in some code three garbage or Wulu garbage. This is a whale and PA siren system. Okay, you got a, a hand mic here. Check, 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 check. Okay, Every, you got everything. It's whaling, it's well designed. You got three tones. So once again, guys, this is a emergency response vehicle, not a Jimmy rig golf cart, and it has everything you would ever want on it. It's the top end model from Moto Electric. Um, you also got a mirror on the passenger side, which is, once again, this is built on a bus style, our, our electric shuttle. So you got the passenger bus style mirror here, driver mirror there. Um, you got your windshield wiper here, regular horn if you wanted to not use, you know, the red button. So you got pretty much everything you would ever want. And then you got the bench style seat in the front, which makes it real comfortable. I mean, look, I'm 6'2". I'm back. My knees aren't touching the dash. It's really, really nice. Has lots of space. You got a nice uh, spot for one of your paramedic friends right here. So it's pretty much got everything you want. Um, but once again, guys, totally customizable. Heaters, air blowers, enclosures. Um, these things go about 50 miles standard on a charge. You can go ahead and, uh, and also get um, you know uh, uh, upgraded batteries to go ahead and increase the range, solar panels, we can do whatever you want. It's all on the website, uh, but you just gotta ask us um, and, and we can help you build a quote. With that said, I did forget to go ahead and show you the prop rod that we did to access your battery, so I wanna go ahead and do that for you, and then we'll wrap this thing up and tell you a little bit about our warranty and what we can do for you. All right, guys, so we're here at the back end. I just well, I forgot to show you guys the deck flip, how to access your batteries. This has 12 total batteries, okay? Um, you got four in one spot, eight in another. So I just wanna show you how you're gonna get this and easy access, because that's one, been one of the things on the, on the uh, mid-range and the low end that some people have requested, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and take this out one more time. I know it's kind of fun to do, but I'm actually doing it just so you guys can see this. So I'm gonna take this out real quick, okay? We'll go ahead and drop this down. Okay, we're good there. Let's go ahead and unhook it and get this stretcher out of the way. Okay, because this, so remember, you're supposed to check your batteries, wet batteries, once every, I'd say month, month and a half. It depends on use. So we'll get that out of the way. So this has got to be an easy process and something that your guys are willing to do. So look at this. So you're going to pull this forward. Okay. And then we're going to go ahead and lift this. Okay. And then we made a convenient rod over here. So we're going to pull the cotter pin. Pull the latch pin, and then look at this, guys. Come on. I mean, it's our guys, they think of everything. They think of everything. We try to make y'all's life easy. And then look, you got four batteries back here. I've already done it on the checkout, but you can go ahead and access your batteries. This has a battery water system. Um, and then back here, you can actually see, I don't know if you could see it from there, but all your batteries, your eight batteries, are sitting here as well. So you can access your batteries. No, uh, no uh, liability. I could put my hand under here, my head under here, but you had to have something to keep it up or it'd be a pain. So we try to make y'all's life easy so they'll maintain it so you don't have to buy more vehicles and save money and go spend it on something else. So with that said, let me wrap this thing up. Moto Electric Vehicle has been known since 2006 for their quality. I don't just say that, okay, but we're a family owned business. My, my father's the owner, I'm the, I'm the son of the owner, and we have a great team. I, I keep stressing that. We sell a lot of vehicles, but we have a great team, a lot of mechanics that have been with us, not one, two years. We have mechanics that have been with us nine, 10, even 11 years. And we, we try to do manufacturing, designing, and do our niches doing something different that not everybody's doing. So once again, we got our five passenger EMS paramedic responder unit. You get a three year limited warranty, three years on the onboard charger, which I didn't even go over. There's just so much to go over on these vehicles. The onboard charger comes with it so you can plug in anywhere you want. Um, three years on that, two years on the controller, 18 months on your Trojan batteries, and then we give you a 12 month guarantee on the rest of the vehicle, non-user wear and tear. So you're totally backed, you got a great product. Come visit our website, motoelectricvehicles.com. 
ask for me, ask for a sales rep, we'll definitely help you out. But guys, once again, anything from a two-seater to a 46-passenger tram, utility, EMS, I could keep talking all day. You don't want to hear me anymore. Call me, 904-247-1818. We can go over it and go over your project. Thank you for joining us on this video, guys.